to Digimon Master Online and welcome back to the channel so today we're gonna talk about uh, the big event that we had in here it's been a while since I made any videos but today this is the event that's gonna make me make a video about it so today the video is about the 8th anniversary of DMO is day or two days ago but we are still having the anniversary until the next maintenance so yeah it's not gonna be back thing so we um if you talk to Kalomon you're gonna see here something new that's called um it's a it's an event quest you can just come talk to him and he's gonna give you the Digi Exoros chips those are for as it's written here it's for evolution actually I don't have any Exoros right now but uh, you can have the Exoros from some of shop in here the Shotmon and the chips as well alongside with Code Crown I don't know what is that for but it's all along with the Exoros stuff and you have something new that's called Atravolt Vidromon X it's totally new Digimon and as you can see it's Power luck thing. So, and uh, but as long as he healed, he's really good, strong Digimon. So yeah, people say it's worth it. But uh, you're gonna try your luck, or you're gonna buy it with Terra if you have too much Terra. Not like me, you just two Terra is nine hundred seven megawatts. Alright, so we're gonna keep on going with our evening. So you're gonna talk to Candlemon. He's gonna give you um. This is a quest that telling you to collect the stuff, and this is a quest. It's a daily. I didn't do it try till now. I just was looking around the event and seeing what the new stuff is. So I really didn't check it, but I didn't complete it. So um, we're gonna forget about that. As well as that, you can get daily stuff. And here with El Common, you're gonna have three quests. And each quest gives you something like seeds and um, water. I think this sounds like water or whatever. You can get those items, you collect them, and then you're gonna make no, your own reward God. here. No, you're gonna God, exchange please, them back no. to him, and then you're gonna get really good stuff. So, and um, if we went here, as um, we had it before with. Uh, Kalatamon X and any other new Digimon that we showed, it's a challenge card. You're gonna get it and go down, summon, and then you're gonna get random items as well. The new thing has been released or has been updated is the Colo. The Colo system has been updated. Before you can just play and keep on going until 99. Today the Digimon is gonna level, gonna go more and more. So like uh, you start with 99 and we can you can go there and if your Digimon is higher than 99 you can do Colo so easily. But right now it's not because after the Digimon 99, that, uh, the Digimon that you have to fight after his level is 99, then you can have another Digimon which is level 100 and then 105, 110, 115 and they're gonna go up as long as you are going. So Colo has become more harder actually, and we have GG! the map again, <laughs> the leveling up map, the burning time map is back again, but today was Here we go an update. Again. As you can see, like before, you don't have anything written here about monster level, because you had only to level until 99, and after that you don't have anything to do, your Digimon won't get any XP after 99, but right now you can level up to 110. And even until 111 is maximum level that you can level in there, and you can't level more than that. Besides that, we have a new map has been released as well. And before we go to the map, I want to show you the stuff that we can make from that map. It's the Digivice. Um, sorry, the Digivice stuff in here. As you can see, you have to collect stuff. You have uh, to collect those items in order to make the Digivice. Um, and as you can see, it has a buff, attacks, and uh, as long as you go higher and higher on Digivices, you're gonna see the more better they get, actually, and the more expensive they are. 
and more stuff that you're gonna need so you're gonna see here you have to collect those stuff um i think this one i i looked around but i think this one you're gonna get uh, from the map because i looked in the shops they are not there i tried to ask around and people said it's from quests but i don't know i didn't have it yet i'm 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 gonna be sure making a video when i had one of these but right now we're gonna go to new map that had been updated oh you can see here as well it's a little bit updated <laughs> so as you can see the new map has been updated is uh, Odaiba you have a new quest in there and you then have the big site and those stuff I didn't so any portal for them but the problem is the gate that you not gonna allow you to pass I don't know why unless you just waited next to the gate and uh, do nothing and then you're surprised there so I'm gonna go and show you how to do the quest and how to get there actually you can go there without even having quest done in any of these maps but if you want to quest in there you have to complete the entire the entire Shibuya map in here all the quests you have to do all the quests in here complete the, all the quests that you have here and then you're gonna find uh, Minato, as I remember, is here. We say next to Moyutsumon. You're gonna find him sitting, uh, standing there, and he's gonna give you this quest that's saying returning home. So he must be here somewhere. Last qu uh, last quest was in here, Moyutsumon. That was the final quest. You do the Moyutsumon raid, and then you're done with map but right now after you do that you have here you have to come here and talk to me to Matt sorry and he's gonna give you uh, this quest this quest that tell you that tells you to go to Minato city and um, in this quest oh we teleported so fast this time last time I tried to go from Shibuya to Minato city I was just standing there and trying to go and go but it didn't went well actually I just stand there and for one or two minutes until I get the pass I remember that you shall not pass okay problem so uh, after you talk to him you can come here and complete the quests as you can see and then you, this way you can have your quests done and then you're gonna be here starting to re to start questing in here on all the way up to big side big side is the last map that you can find I tried to look around to see what are those maps but I did I couldn't find any portal in here I mean if you come here to Odaiba you're gonna come from this way and if you look around you won't find anything and as long as with uh, um, with a big site as well to the Odaiba as you can see there's no way that you can reach those maps I don't I think those maps are are under work right now I'm not sure if they are gonna be launched anytime soon or later I really don't have any idea about that but this is the update that it has been released on DMO and alongside with a new raid Digimon with a new Digimon that's been released and um, as you can see it's pretty cool so the Digimons are there and they are, they are still 112, 113 so you can keep on leveling on and you can keep on doing your stuff so this is what we had it this is a big update that we had it and of course I forgot to mention that from the old guy I always forget his name the old dude in there that we always go and talk to him and he give us really randomly quests this dude in here yeah this dude is gonna give you like um, two quests to do the first quest is to, uh, to go and uh, yeah, the first quest is to do this the record of the desert this is the first quest that you have to do and the second quest 
from him is I think as long as I remember them, just one is to do the raids in um, the entire map as you can see they are if you do this raids he's gonna give you the achievement and he's gonna give you XP and those fruits that you don't even gonna be used and that was the huge update that we had in DMO. I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.